Do you see it's all pointing? You're entering the man cave, also known as the bridge, also known as the... What else do you call this? The wing, the... What do you call this area? I call it the bridge. I'm sorry. Should we start over? No, let's just go. <laughs> it's called the, the breezeway. Okay, well... I but guess. no, it's officially the bridge, so... Okay. The, the, the breezeway, sorry. <laughs> I got nixed on that, so. You know why this is going south? Because this is what Harold's been doing all yep. day yep. long. I drained those bottles. <laughs> TJ, help me. Twenty-two dollars on that. We're a little delirious. Okay, twenty-two dollars on this handcrafted uh, vintage bar from Mexico. Twenty-two dollars. The man cave sign, you guys. I love that. Uh, come back to us because someone's gonna want that, and we don't know how much it is. Um, some great bottles here from Mexico, all shot empty. glasses, all empty. Again, Harold, blame Harold. TJ. <laughs> and TJ. Okay, popping in here, um, some repeats, but a lot of fun stuff. We got the blue glass, we got the tiles, anything you want to point out? Um, so, did add a lot of new uh, blue glass glasses. There's a canister set that is new. So, um, again, if you're interested in that, for you to pop in, take a that um, to the producer's right in that box with lots of treasures with the glass front. Always add new stuff in there. We have people that always like to go there first and check out what's what's new in there. People so. do love that little, they like to dig around in there. Yeah, it's a good treasure. Kind of treasure, treasure chest. So. The purple glass on your left, and then you're going to see a cute little, uh, it looks like a bird cage with a cat looking down on it. Uh, you can actually put candles in there, right? Yes, a little votive set. Okay. And well, then we've got Cat World. And we have our cookbooks. Yes, kitty cat world. Uh, you know how I always talk about cats and how they're not my favorite? Well, I'm probably going to eat my words soon. I think we need a barn cat. I think we do. Yeah. We'll and just... I think the dogs would love that. I think they would be best friends. Yes. <laughs> so get your kitty cats here. Um, and then again, the cookbooks, which you mentioned, the vintage recipes here. Um, coming in over here, I love this. It is still available. $2.98. We can move this out really easily. Because it's empty. Because it is empty. Um, a few things on top. But. Yes, a couple things on top, but hey, we're used to that. Uh, the turquoise cabinet here. How much? That's the frame. I think it's 198. Okay, 34 on the frame with the American flag in that. I love that. The green glass. Um, it's called the Vaseline glass. No. Um, Vaseline glass is this. That's kind of that transparent color, and it does glow in the dark. And, right. Um, yes. Or also known as uranium glass because mm -hmm. it has uranium in it, mm -hmm. and uh, but added a lot of new uh, green in this section. Um, quite a few pieces. Sold. Really pretty. Did you get the full pan? And um, some <laughs> dishes down there, some dish sets. So <laughs> pan, pan. Okay, we're gonna push pause. So we're gonna have a glass of lemonade. I, I wish. wish. <laughs> Jinx. <laughs> Jinx, you owe me a lemonade. Yes. Okay. Um, Delf uh, pottery or whatever it's called. <laughs> the heat. TJ's like, oh, no. What's going on, Harold? I need a popsicle. Yes. Okay, come on in here. Um, and this is the hardware section. It is. Um, and there's a baby foot. <laughs> there's a little baby foot there. There's a doll foot in there. That's the art, art section. What is that? It's just, uh, it's all vintage pieces. Uh, artists put that together. Oh, creative, creative. Okay, 198 on the amazing vintage bird cage. It is five and a half feet tall. You guys, that's a phenomenal deal. If nothing else, put plants in it. You don't even have right. to put your birds in it. You, were, you wouldn't even have to really put anything in it. No. It's just, it's colorful, it's a great piece. Yeah, so if you, if you don't know what to do with a bird cage that large, go out to where we have the old vintage truck on the side of the barn, and we have huge bird cages. A few of them and, and bird houses that around that size size and um, it's a pretty cool look and eventually the ivy grows into it and it's, it's a really nice if nothing else you can put your spouse in it right okay didn't hear that here. no <laughs> and we will not tattle on you hummingbird up here um, this planter has needs some love because I love this thing someone get that already yes very very old a ton of character we've had a few of them with the wicker uh, but this is the real McCoy with the iron. Uh, we've got some stained glass up here, $20, $22. The bird feeders, $26. Bucks. Uh, he's he's showing you what they do. Yes, demonstrating. Yeah, yep. Um, fennials, people love their fennials. We sell a lot of these. Um, and then spin around. 
Anything and new? Two, two new lightning rods. Oh, nice. Um, so not as fancy as yours okay. with the weather directional, okay. but there's this one. Both have the original um, milk glass insert. So there's this one, and then there's this one right here, um, and both are 168. And just oh, brought, those are awesome. Just brought those in today. Those are awesome. And if you need to know what that means and what you would do with it, watch my previous video and I talk about it. Okay, miscellaneous kitchen pieces in here. Anything you want to point out? Um, well, it is wedding season, and this uh, is a I don't know, I'm dreaming of, of ice cream. Or a cold drink. <laughs> uh, but this is a Victorian, um, uh, what's that, you? I just said, <laughs> I'm hot, I'm fanning. Uh, but it's called a bank basket, and they would put these out at like the reception, and people would give them money, and they uh, would hold the money. And typically they that were held only, the mic? Uh -huh, so that but typically they were only one level. So the, obviously this couple was hoping for a lot more. A little greedy. And uh, Mr. Went, and Mrs. Went Smith. Tears. Twenty-eight dollars. The uh, hand-blown uh, glaze vase hanging. Uh, hanging could also be at the beginning of the tag. Hanging hand-blown glaze vase. Okay. <laughs> TJ's not impressed. We're melting. I shouldn't say that. People are gonna get no, discouraged. It's, it's really cold. actually really cold. I, 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 I wish that coke jacket. I'm gonna me, put that I coke jacket back on. Yes. Pink glass right here. Talk to me about that. Yeah. So uh, several different companies here, but there's some uh, Pilgrim glass in there. This um, uh, cake stand is hard to find as well. Forty-eight dollars on that. Cool vase here. Vintage. Twenty-eight dollars on that. That looks very Moroccan. So this little collection I just purchased, and uh, this one is Art Nouveau. And it is like 1890 to 1910, and that is uh, sterling on there. Um, $98 on this one. The other three are um, from Italy. So they were oh. done in Italy, and they have the uh, sterling on the glass as well. So $98 on this one, uh, $78 on the two with the stoppers, and then this one right here is $28. Those are beautiful. Those are lovely. I put those right on a vanity. Um, TJ okay. said he'd like to drink his tequila. From <laughs> it is a TJ little bottle right there. Yes. We've got some nice silver, um, and they are, oh, I love how they're engraved. Give thanks, $18. Serve with love. All of that stuff matters. People can mm -hmm. taste love in the food, can't yes. they? Okay. Uh, our little cheese do them over here. That would make a great charcuterie platter. Uh, you can put some cheeses there and meats and whatnot in there. And then if you grab these little things, you put that in the cheese. So you've got your cheddar cheese and your brie or your gorgonzola or whatnot. Uh, just poke that right into your... And even uh, if it's not cheddar, just do that and see if people go along with it. Yeah. Put it into your mozzarella. That doesn't bowl of. taste like cheddar. <laughs> okay. Duck. The real McCoy. Get it? Mm -hmm. Um... No. <laughs> we feel like we need to edit this whole video. Okay. Pillar. Talk to me about the pillar, Harold. So vintage, um, out of a staircase in an old home. Um, but I love the way that somebody had painted it $128 on that. Okay. Cute little tiles in here. $10. Set of four for those. Um, that would be fun for a bathroom. Mm -hmm. um, adding a little uh, pattern to an otherwise boring bathroom. Right. Speaking of board. But happy. Look at how cute he is. Um, some great blue bottles, $18 on that. Um, coming on over here, we. Who's here? Is that my husband? Uh, $38 on this, the rusty bird feeder. Um, bird cages, little bird houses, whatnot, go high. Look at all of the hummingbird feeders over there. $2.98 on Harold's favorite piece of pottery in the barn. Yes. He was going to keep it, but he brought it in it to share it with you. Right. If you don't buy it, it's okay. He'll, right. keep, he'll take it home. Keep These it. two pieces are new, mm. so handcrafted, um, but could be like utility table, uh, garden bench, and I think $1.98 on that 228 on this one and this one is on casters so oh the casters are the best you guys this would be great as a bar you wheel it around uh, or a potting bench as well tj said that's my that's my bar shelf down there it is and this is mommy and daddy's right. we've got some great um peterborough baskets as well those are phenomenal some of them even with the leather handles the primitive tool trunk for 198 on that yes um that's beautiful those are beautiful those would be really nice for a bathroom right really classy a $38 handcrafted, $38 a handcrafted um, herb art. Um, and it's, see how it's all dried like that. Here's the bowl with the tiny horns. Yes. For 98. Keep talking about 
his horns. I'm get waiting for him. That's look how sad he looks. I'm waiting for Harold to take it away because I can't keep going. <laughs> Coming on over here. Beautiful piece of pottery. I do not remember this. Um, it's It was here last show. Oh, was it? Okay. Um, but cool and very heavy. Um, and unique. And unique. Yeah. $28 on the horse, holding the dog, holding the cat, which is true love, $28. Yeah. Then you get on over to a little bit of a cooler section, which kind of has this. Just, it just drops here like 20 degrees and <laughs> got to the coast. We were in the sun patch, so that's what yes. happened. Okay, this is all coastal vibe going on. This is phenomenal. We've got the uh, seabird, the seagull on the... Um... Post? No, it's a, called a... Pier? Yes, that's what I was going for, pier post. Okay. $78. No. <laughs> okay, so TJ went looked at me like. Okay, do you guys know um do you guys know the artist Wyland? You know how it specializes in the whales? Okay, very, very famous. If you don't know about that, this is pretty phenomenal. $38 on that bottle. Uh so it's very cool, one of a kind. Um, another one, so these are artist inspired uh bottles that you Burn. could uh fill with uh limoncello. Yes, or water. But <laughs> Lemoncello would be better. Okay. Maybe we wouldn't see it. The picture is clear. No, but you wouldn't. We'd have a yellow tent, but that's okay. That's, those are really cool bottles, though. Okay. Well, then we've got our pelican here for fifty-eight dollars. Uh, we've got some seashell motif going on down here. The sea, the the sailboat down very low. If you want to get down there, producer, if you feel like it, you don't have to though. <laughs> Just pan. Our whale tail holding a bottle, yes. uh, which is really cool, especially if uh, so. Twenty-eight dollars if you. Chill. <laughs> I'm about to open my drawers uh, for $38 because it's really hot in here. Little fishy fish, put a candle in his belly, $68. Um, it is two pieces. He comes off of his um, reef. Yes. <laughs> Speaking of reefer, <laughs> somebody's high. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I love these spritzer bottles. Very, very cool. This one is my favorite one in the barn. Um, I almost said bar. 46 bucks on that. The other side of the table, you can kind of get a peekaboo here. Don't don't forget to look high and low. I believe that is also a wine rack. It is a wine rack. Okay. I had two of those, one sold last show. Only $18, you guys. And that's great for a small apartment or uh, a small little area. Bell City. Jeez Louise, Harold. Last show, there are people like, we're looking for bells. Well, here you go. It's a comparison. There you go. Those are great. And then we have all of our cowbells in here. Oh, poor Roxy. She's like, I hate noise. Sorry, Roxy. That's more your style. Tons of them in there. Don't be afraid to ding a ling bling. Um, the snowflake, a lot of people love that. Yeah. So tell me about that. Um, it's handcrafted, it's glass, it's um, and leaded. $58, a lot of work went into that. It's got some nice weight to it. See how, it's, how it, um, it casts prisms? Yes. <laughs> That's all I gotta say about that. <laughs> uh. Funny how I showered before I came in here. <laughs> so, vintage sundial, large, um, kind of unusual to find one this size, 128 on that. Um, hat stand here or coats rack because you need those right now because you need a coat with you at all times. Uh, you 98, never know when it's dollars on that. And the Golden Girls are in the house. <gasps> oh, that's Four cool. Four stemless wine glasses, $28. Oh, that is so cool. Okay. You have cocktails with the Golden Girls. Yeah. Get that for your girls. Uh, what's that game you play when you're uh, bunko? For your yes. bunko club. Club. Right. There you go. Okay, coming on over here. We've talked about some of this before. I love that. I like how you did that. You want to talk about it? So just a uh, hand-blown vase, but very cool the way those five vases are connected and water flows through. $22 on that. Uh, Victorian beaded um, flowers and in the 20s, depending on the stem. Mm -hmm. and the sailboat stained glass, which is great for this show. Right. $38 on that. Right. Uh, this is vintage okay. Limoges uh, from France, $68 on this ginger jar. Um, this cake plate is new, this show, uh, $38 on that. Okay, we have our lanterns with the red glass. We are looking at $98 each or $180 for the pair. Um, don't forget the flamingo. Planter. Oh, hi. Oh. <laughs> what am I looking at? What am I looking at? 
Um, also, this is uh, Murano glass. This is a very cool piece, um, hand blown, mm. and um, Yum. <laughs> ninety-eight dollars on that. <laughs> if you want to see a real flamingo in the wild, go to um, what's it called? San Diego Zoo. <laughs> Not what I was going for, but okay. sure, whatever, save some money. I was trying to tell you a place in Mexico, in oh. Yucatan, but that's okay. okay. Okay, come on over here. My brain's failing me. Um, I know, I see. Um, she's giving me the boob sink. Okay, this lovely little princess here, $18. Um, don't forget the lockers, the yes. vintage school lockers that just came in last show. These are incredible as well, beautiful, and they even have my favorite thing on the bottom. Um, yes. So those are $58 for the pair. Um, pink glass over here and uh, the Buddha head or I don't know. Buddha had to close her, his eyes because the sun. The sun. <laughs> this is fun. Three minutes, four minutes and five minute timer. Yes. That's really cool. And yes. I like that it's pink and black. Yes. And it's Fashan, which is a French um, chocolate. Oh, that's great. Only $18 on that. By the way, the French plate, uh, we went out to dinner with my boss and his wife and we gave it to them because we loved it. Loved it. Cool. So thank you, Harold. Yes. Um, always looking for great gifts in here. Um, okay, coming on over here, the Rustic uh, Barrel 128. The Vintage Sign is new for $28 as well. The Metal Sun, $28. Anything that we're missing? I, or, think, uh, I, think, I think we're good. Uh, okay. Well, then meet us in the garden room. We'll be right back.